Um, let's try to get some cash here. Let's go ahead and break down the games in this one. Myself and Alex today, a little two-man show, but we will do our best to break down these games, guys. Let's go over here. First game up, let's head over here to the streets of Cleveland here, where we have the Cavaliers land five and a half points at the house versus the Washington Wizards here, getting back plus five and a half on the road here. If you'd like to go the money line route, have our land minus 220 here as the home favorite here, or you can take the Wizards home, uh, the away underdog here, getting back plus 180 on the money line here. Over and under, sitting at 221 and a half in this one, Alex. Um, how you liking this one, my brother? You, uh, do you think the Cavs can keep it going here? Or do the Wizards uh, can the Wizards get this game here? It's one of those situations where you're so far late in the season, and uh, this game just profiles in really sort of straightforward way. The Cavaliers have just been the nuts at home. Uh, they're fantastic. They really up their level of playing. Now, Jarrett Allen is out, which I think is a, a really big reduction. I think he's worth a couple points to this Cavaliers team, who is still good, but having that second rim protector really matters a lot. The Wizards have been real solid, but you know, five and a half, pretty close to where I had it. The total sits right about here. I know we're talking about this one. Josh can't make the show today there's no internet in australia or something um he liked the Cavs here minus five and a half but i, I think that's kind of the look it's Cavs or pass uh, again a little edge for me i had this closer to six six and a half but i'm happy to let this one go yeah, I'm right there with you. I could actually see this game going either way. The Wizards have been losing versus some top-tier teams, in my opinion. They do need to win every one of these games if they don't want to get bumped out of the play-in tournament over there in the uh, Eastern Conference as well. So Personally, I, I don't want to bet against the Cavs at the house, but I must say, without Jared Allen, um, I can say, man, that the Wizards here with Kuzma, with uh, Kuzma, man, it's tough. It's going to be tough to stretch this one, but uh, uh, Kuzma, Porzingis, and Gafford down low, I must say, man, three, three bigs here, um, they do have the advantage down low with you only having Mobley over there and no real backup center as well for the Cavs in that one, guys. So um, I do think the Wizards have some matchup advantages in this game. They're coming off some losses, coming off a few days rest as well in this one, Alex. So when you look at Kuzma, Porzingis, and Gafford down low, would you agree that the Wizards have the advantage when it comes to the big guys at least? It's it's tough, again, especially without Allen, but Mobley and some of the other guys in this team should be fine here tonight. And uh, the matchup, as, as we've seen this season, I was going back and looking, they've played twice already so far. Cleveland beat them by 10 at home, beat them by 25 on the road here. And, um, you know, that's with Porzingis, Kuzma, and Bradley Beal playing in just about every one of those games. So um, I think really it comes down to, if you're Washington, uh, you know, can Bradley Beal maybe take advantage of Donovan Mitchell defensively, something like that. It's, it is just a tough matchup for them but like you said with with all that size maybe with just without Jared Allen and just Mobley there's just a little too much going on down there so take a look at how Washington does offensive rebounding see if they try to attack the boards that could be an interesting edge for them Got right, you, got you. So, uh, no official plays for myself or Alex on this one, but we do. But our guy Josh, who couldn't make the show today because of internet issues, he is on the Cavs here, minus the five and a half, guys. So, Josh rocking with the Cavs official. If you're looking for official play in this one, our guy Josh has you covered. Cavs minus five and a half, guys.